This bucket is completely full of this kind of stuff. Every coin collection, it, it seems like there's going to be some of this material in it. And what is this stuff? These are actually old U.S. coins, but they have been packaged in such a way that they can be sold, and in my opinion, charged way too much for. There's nothing wrong with any of these coins. What I see being done with them when they're packaged this way is what is wrong. People pay ridiculous amounts of money. Coins, they could go to their coin shop, local coin shop, and pay 30 cents, 60 cents. They're paying 10, 20, 50 dollars a piece. And when you don't know anything about coins, and you're not a coin expert, and you're not a collector, and you're sitting at home, and a commercial comes on, and suddenly the Wild West is riding before you, and you've got all of this history and all of the imagery, suddenly this seemed like an awful lot of history to get for $29.95. How can that be a bad deal? Well, it can be a bad deal because you could have gone to your local coin shop and bought the whole thing for a dollar or two. Not with this folder, not with these pictures, but certainly the coins. You can put them in your own holder. You don't need to pay for all of this. And often this is just the beginning. They sign you up for a service that you'll get one every week, every two weeks, every month. However, until you squeal, they'll send them to you. So when you see coins packaged this way, that's fine, but Consider that you might be being sold something a little bit more than you were looking for. Stop at your local coin shop, whether it's us or somebody else, and look and see what you can get before you buy that thing off television or any other type of advertisement. When you see them packaged this way, your antenna should go up.